My name is Mastura Munif and I'm a clinician researcher and the area of research that we are focusing on now currently is on glioblastoma. Glioblastoma is the most common form of primary brain cancer and why am I researching or why am I working in this area? The main reason is because it's one of the most aggressive cancers and uh, it's one of the areas that um, actually needs a lot of research and you know a lot of development and with uh, you know with hopefully um, avenues to improving treatment and to improving our patient uh, population's survival. So th the main reason why I'm working in this area is to be able to improve longevity and quality of life for our patients. That with consent of our patients we take a small sample of their tumor and to the lab and then once it's in the lab we examine the tumor to get a, a, a better understanding of how the cells are operating within the petri dish but at the same time the knowledge that we gain in the lab we transfer that knowledge back to the clinical setting. Um, so one of the recent discoveries that we are working on is uh, involves a protein called P2X7. P2X7 uh, is expressed on tumor cells, patient-derived tumor cells, as well as immune cells within the tumor. And we have found uh, in the lab that if you inhibit this protein with various pharmacological compounds or various pharmacological drugs that specifically inhibits this protein, we can actually reduce tumor growth in the lab. And the data that we have found is showing that our drugs are actually much better or much more efficacious than that of a conventional chemotherapy that's available at the moment. Um, so this is quite promising and we want to take these findings into further preclinical studies and hopefully in the next few years to take, to take our findings from the lab into a phase one human clinical trial. And so together we can um, help improve and also save the lives of uh, people with glioblastoma. So our work is very collaborative. Um, uh, we conduct the research at the Department of Neurosciences at Monash University, but we are also collaborating with our colleagues from the Alfred Brain Tumor Biobank and Department of Neurosurgery at the Alfred. In addition to that, we're also collaborating with many of our colleagues at the Department of Neurology at the Alfred and many of our colleagues at the Department of Neurosurgery at the Royal Melbourne Hospital. And of course, none of this work is actually doable and none of it is achievable without contribution from our patients. First of all, they, they provide a sample from their tumor. And of course, this is at a time when, you know, um, they're going through it's a, it's a massive life-changing event for them but at the same time you know they're actually contributing to science and, and so we are extremely grateful from that perspective but also in our day-to-day -day work and day-to-day -day research and we do have patient engagement and their participation in our work as well.